Hello YouTube Makeup Lovers. So I just finished filming my January favorites and in the video I shared with you a lipstick that was my favorite for the month of January which was the Maybelline Color Sensational The Buffs, that line that is full of nude colors and I love nude colors. So I was color. really excited to see this line come out and I immediately had to have some of these lipsticks. I bought one first I loved it so much that I ended up going back and buying four more. So now I have a total of five. So I wanted to show you these five colors that I have, show you the swatches, just in case you're checking out this lipstick line of nude colors and you want to go out and buy one. So maybe this video might help you out. I think that they have a nude lipstick pretty much for every skin tone, for every taste, anything you want. They have a total of 10 colors. So I got half of them because they're the ones that I thought for me would be the best and more my style. I love nude lipsticks and I just really, really like them. So I'm going to tell you a little bit about them. I'm definitely going to show you swatches. So I just really hope that this video helps you out and of course that you have a lot of fun watching it. So first I want to show you the shades of the 10 colors. Unfortunately, the ones that I can show you really, really well are the five that I have. But I did want you guys to see the range of the colors that they do have. So I'm going to show you here on my iPad. I hope you can see them well. They're right here. Here are the 10 colors. I didn't get for sure the first one just because it was a really, really light nude. And it's a typical light concealer-like color on my skin tone that I always avoid. And I also didn't get some of the really, really dark ones towards the end right here. Just because I really don't wear those colors that much. And I really like to just stick to the nudes that are more like pinky nudes or neutral nudes. Kind of like the one that I'm wearing right now. So I did get a lot of the colors in the middle. So I'm going to tell you exactly which were the ones that I got. And um, I'm going to show you swatches of those. I think I already mentioned that at the beginning of the video. But I'm going to start with that right now. So the five colors that I have are 915, 920, 930, 935, and 945. So I'm going to go one by one through them. I'm going to tell you the number, the name, show you a swatch. And then I'll see what else I can add to the video just to make at least these five colors really clear to you guys so that you guys can see them. The lightest color that I got from the collection was number 915 Blushing Beige. It is their second lightest color in the entire collection. And I really, really liked it. Let me show you a swatch, which is, can you see that? It's right there. And I'm also going to show you the lipstick. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to apply the lipstick one after the other so that you can see how it applies and you can see the color a little bit up close. So I'll do that after every single swatch that I showed you. This is the 915. The second color I got is 920 and it's Nude Lust. And the color looks like this. And let me show you the swatch right now. There it is right there. So there you see the first color and the second color. got is called truffle teas number 930 it is this one right here I will make sure to hold them side by side so that you see what they look like but as you can see they are getting a little darker as I go up there are the first three they feel so nice apply really easily Truffle Tees is actually the first one that I ever purchased. It is the one that I showed in my January favorites. So I'm going to link my January favorites down below. Then I got number 935 called Cinnamon with an S as in Sin. And the color looks like this. And here is the swatch.
These lipsticks even look good without gloss. So this is no gloss whatsoever. And with gloss, they just look really beautiful as well. And the last color that I got is 945 called Stormy Sahara. And it is this one right here. And let me show you the last swatch. Let me see. Really good color payoff, all these colors. I don't know if this helps at all, but here are the five colors. I'm gonna take a picture of this because this is just not working out. But here are the five colors. I don't know if that helps. I can't cover it with my hand. I can't hold all five in one hand. So just a little bit more about the colors. They were $8.75. I bought them at CVS. I did use a coupon, so I got a lot off. I had a 20% off coupon, I had a $5 extra bucks coupon, and another $5 extra bucks coupon. So I did save a lot of money. I just went ahead and got them. They didn't have any buy one, get one half off deals, unfortunately, when I went. But they were great, and I'm happy that I bought them. I can't remember if I showed you, but this is the packaging. Very similar to the square packaging of the Vivid. It just has a lighter color. It's not the clear, bright one. They do have a smell. The smell doesn't bug me at all. I don't think it's like a really strong smell. It's not like an annoying smell for me. If it smells terrible, I can't use it no matter how beautiful the color is. Ooh, I just got that on my nose. But it does have a smell. I think it reminds me a lot of the Color Vivid Sensational smell from Maybelline as well. So if you have those, you can probably compare. It's not exactly the same. It is very similar. To me, it kind of reminds me, the nude ones, a little bit of Play-Doh. Um, and I used to love the smell of Play-Doh. So that's what first comes to mind when I smell them. So if smells bug you, then this might bug you. But it really is not bad at all. So I just really have been liking these lipsticks. I hope you go out and check them out. They have more shades. I only have these five. These are the five that I know that I would use. I didn't want to get any more of the darker ones or the really light one just because I know that I will probably just end up never using them. So I didn't really want to spend the money on those. But these, I know that I will use a lot. I love them. Well, that is pretty much it. I really hope that you enjoyed this video and that it helped you out and that you check out some of these nude lipsticks. If I had to pick two, I would definitely pick number 920 and number 930. I think they're very different nudes. One is more of a pinky nude and one is more, I guess, of a, I don't know, beigey, brownish nude. So I think they're actually very, very different. This one is a 920. 930 and I just have really been liking these so if you really like nude lipsticks I think that you will really enjoy these and of course they're fine at the drugstore so you can't beat it if you can find a buy one get one 50% off deal you can get a couple of them for a really really great price if you like this video and if it helped you out please give it a thumbs up and please subscribe if you haven't already and as always thank you so so much for watching Be Lounge Makeup bye